Hi class, Assalamualaikum. A very good morning. Uh, today I'm going to do a uh, reducing sugar test. Okay, uh, and I'm using banana. Uh, banana as uh, the sample. Okay, why am I using banana? Yeah, as you all know, banana has uh, a very uh, high level sugar. Yeah, this is a uh, high carbohydrate. Uh, food okay so that's why uh, we are using uh, banana yeah instead of uh, apple yeah pineapple and so on okay so for this test yeah reducing sugar test yeah uh, we are going to uh, test the uh, glucose yeah glucose level and we are going to use uh, benedict yeah, benedict reagent uh, as the test kit Okay, guys, let's observe. You know, this is a fresh banana. Okay, you, you can see it's juicy. Yeah, you know, but this is the ripe banana. Yeah, you, know, you can see uh, it's very light and not juicy anymore. You know, very dry. Yeah, you know, this is the ripe banana. Okay. You can dif differentiate yeah? the fresh, juicy banana with the ripe one. Yeah? It's become dry. Yeah? The taste also sweet. Yeah, but the ripe banana is not sweet anymore. Okay. So you can make a hypothesis. Yeah, which one uh, has uh, more sugar level? Yeah. So I can suggest you. Uh, you can uh, have a hypothesis that a uh, fresh banana has a uh, uh, high sugar level okay yeah. or you can say also that um, ripe banana has a uh, low sugar level when you are uh, writing a hypothesis yeah, you can uh, either write the wrong or correct yeah it's okay yeah? because uh, for example you can say uh, is there a high sugar level in ripe banana or maybe you can say is there a high sugar level in uh, fresh banana yeah because in writing a hypothesis uh, there is no uh, right or wrong yeah? The important is the result of the hypothesis. Yeah, when you are doing the conclusion, yeah, when you are going uh, do, doing the conclusion, you will either accept yeah, the hypothesis or you are going to uh, uh, write that uh, we are that the hypothesis is a uh, fail to be accepted. Okay, uh, why don't uh, we? Uh, from now on, we write a proper uh, result uh, of the hypothesis. Yeah? As you can uh, read, yeah? uh, there are many students that write hypothesis accepted and hypothesis rejected. Yeah? But the proper way to write hypothesis is not hypothesis rejected, but hypothesis is fail to be accepted. Yeah? That is the proper way actually. Yeah, so from now, now on, yeah, uh, why not you uh, doing the right thing? Uh, don't write anymore uh, that the hypothesis is reject rejected. It's not wrong, but the proper way is uh, you write that hypothesis is failed to be accepted. That is the right way. Okay. Okay. Five gram, yeah, of ripe banana, and I'm also going to use five gram of fresh banana. Okay, after. 
after I mash uh, the banana, yeah, I will mix with uh, 10 ml of um, distilled water. Okay, let's make the banana juice. Okay, this is the fresh banana juice. It's more juicy than the ripened one. Okay, then I will put uh, 10 ml of Benedict solution. You can see there is slightly green color, okay, yellow and green. It become yellowish. An orange color. You can see it become orange. 